Hey Libra, thank you so much for tuning in. How are you guys? Hope you guys are doing well. And I want to wish you a happy Labor Day weekend ahead of time. Um, what else? I mean, that's if you're in the United States. Because <laughs> I know I have a lot of um, people from all over. So, But for those of you who are in the U.S., okay, enjoy your Labor Day. Be safe, all right? So this is going to be a general reading to see who or what is coming towards you in love. Please um, take the messages however they resonate for your situation. I could be speaking from the perspective of the person that you're dealing with, a.k.a. the cross watcher. Um, you know, this could be something happening now in the near future or the future. Okay. This is a general reading. It will not, uh, it's not supposed to resonate for you to the T. So if you need a personal reading, a precise reading, feel free to check out my website. Okay. I have affordable prices. That's prettyintuitivetarot.com. So let's get into it. Libra, sun, moon, rising, Venus. Who or what is coming towards Libra in love, please, spirit? Tap me into the collective of Libra. Tap me into their higher self. Allow me to interpret these messages with clarity, please. Who or what's coming towards Libra in love? Who or what's coming towards Libra in love? Libra. Okay. Oh, Libra, you have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Okay. I think I'm just going to pull uh, one card. Express your love. Okay. Does somebody want to express their love to my Libras? Hmm. Somebody want to finally, you know, move their stubborn ass and say something? Let's see. Libra, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Angels, who or what's coming towards the Libra collective in love, please? Who or what, Libra? Oh, shit. Libra in love, Libra. Okay. All right, Libra. So, you have um, the Six of Cups. All right. This is definitely someone from your past coming on in. Oh, you have the coming together. What? And the fine balance. Two of Pentacles. You may have been seeing 222 a lot, 666, 333. These could be angel numbers in regards to this connection that you have with someone. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Who or what is coming towards the Libra collective? You could be dealing with a Taurus, Libra. am I picking up on? Gemini, Scorpio. Who or what's coming towards Libra and love, please, spirit? Show me what I need to see for Libra. Who is coming towards them in love? Who or what? Libra, please. Libra. Libra, you have the Six of Pentacles. The Hermit in the reverse could be a Virgo. Capricorn, who or what is coming towards Libra in love, please, Spirit? Libra. Libra, who is coming towards them in love? Page of Pentacles, okay. One more card for Libra. Who is coming towards Libra in love? Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Actually, I'm going to take the Three of Pentacles and the Heart of Pentacles. I'll put that in the, on the side. Could be done with the Pisces. Um, Libra, what I'm picking up, this could this is definitely some. You could be done with another Libra. Um, I have Scorpio here. I think I said that already. But Libra, I'm, this is someone who maybe ghosted you. Um, they have not said anything to you. This is someone who, it's almost like there's some things that are left unsaid between you and this person. The Eight of Swords is in the reverse. For a lot of you, the Six of Wands in the reverse. For a lot of you, I feel like this person has some growing up, some maturing to do. And I also feel like this person may have been, um, had low self-esteem, or they thought they weren't good enough for you for whatever reason. Because the Six of Wands in reverse could definitely be um, low confidence, low self-esteem. Yeah. This person wants to bring balance. Maybe they were breadcrumbing you. Maybe they were not really giving us you maybe you found yourself giving more than this other person so it wasn't really balanced libra is what i'm picking up you have the find balance card here 
Yeah. So it looks like they're ready to meet you halfway. They're ready to uh, reciprocate your effort, reciprocate your love. Because I feel like this is someone who, you know, they've, they've loved you for a long time. They've always had those feelings, but they've always kept it under control. They've always kept it to themselves. The King of Cups is not expressive with his emotions. He will not tell you how he feels. He will not do that, okay? He has complete control um, over his emotions. But it looks like I have Taurus here as well, okay? But this person wants to build with you. They want to take the relationship to the, um, the connection to the next level. For some of you, if this was like an ex-boyfriend, ex-girlfriend, whatever the case may be, um, they may propose moving in together. Maybe they may propose, you know, let's be married for some of you out there. Not all of you, okay? But I just feel like this person really sees you as marriage material, Libra. They see you as someone they would really like to, if you don't have a family with them already, they would like to start a family with you. But they just needed to kind of get outside of them, outside of their head. They just needed to get outside of the fear that they had okay they needed to um remove themselves remove the blindfolds remove themselves from the from a self-imposed jail or prison that they that they put themselves in in regards to coming towards you and speaking tr truthfully from the heart why is the six of pentacles here this is someone i really strongly feel like they were like breadcrumbing you knight of pentacles Knight of Swords. This is also someone who is moving extremely slow. And I do feel like you found yourself having a lot of sleepless nights about this person. Yeah. This is someone who really, um, they also have trust issues. So this is why they really, uh, they've always had the intention to come back to you or to come to you to express their feelings. They've always had the intention, but almost like they were just playing it safe the whole time. Okay. It was a block on their love. They didn't want to act right away. It's just like this. It's almost like they just wanted to like make sure that everything checks out. I mean, this is someone really cautious. Why is the hermit here in the reverse? It could also be you. So they really took some hermit time, Libra. They really went ghost, not because you know they just did it to be an asshole. This person really went ghost because they were emotionally immature. They had a lot of um, emotional healing and maturing to do. Although they did see you as their Ten of Cups, they seen you as someone that, you know, they could marry or really be with, but they had some growing up to do. Page of Cups in the reverse. They had growing up to do. They also had, like, trust issues. Why is the King of Cups here? Because now this person is showing up as a king. You get what I'm saying? Before they were all page. Now they're showing up as a king. Why is the king of cups here? For Libra. This person is coming towards Libra in love. Why is the king of cups here? So this person wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you, Libra. They're ready to open up. For some of them, you know, their past was really doing a number on them. So they were too busy focusing on those cups here, on what went wrong between you guys or in their past to turn around and see that there's a connection here worth taking a look at this person was maybe very stubborn but it looks like now they want to heal the situation they want forgiveness yeah this person had to heal from their past libra that's what they needed to do they needed to heal from their past that's all that that the problem was now they feel like um they they've done their soul searching their their hermit time it's almost like the, now they're ready they're ready now libra why is the page of pentacles here? If you don't want this person back, you shouldn't even be watching this video because, you know, I'm really getting an energy of a Libra who really, who really does love this person. And you are being as patient as you can be with them. Yeah, this person was holding back. Be a Leo that you were dealing with, being very stubborn. But now it's like their guard is coming down, Libra. They were running away from the commitment. They were running away from their feelings. Although they've always cared about you, Libra. Why is the Eight of Swords here in the reverse for Libra? See? For, for um, some of you, this could be a, definitely a twin flame. It could be a Gemini you're dealing with. But, you know, they're ready to approach this divine connection now. They feel ready. 
They feel ready. They had to really go off on their own, Libra. They're ready for a whole new world with you, a whole new cycle with you. Could be an Aquarius. Tell me more about the Eight of Swords. Yeah, they're ready. Before they were going back and forth, but they're ready to bring balance to the connection now, Libra. Why is the Six of Wands in reverse here? See? You got the Emperor could have been dealing with an Aries, an Eight of Pentacles in the reverse, the Devil in the reverse, the Three of Wands. Yeah. This person were, you know, they was just extremely stubborn. They just didn't want to get away from their ego as well. People who have ego problems, overinflated egos, it's usually because they're insecure. If you didn't know that, now you know. It's usually because they are grossly insecure, like deep down, so they're super insecure and sensitive, okay? And this is why they will try to make up for that. They will compensate for that with, you know, you know, being very arrogant and asshole-ish and selfish and standoffish, shit like that. You know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, this person just, um, that's all it was really about for this person, Libra. But they've always seen a future with you. They've always been able to picture it. Judgment. Someone from the past. Oh, definitely returning. See? Told you. Someone from the past. They're returning, Libra. I feel like this is what you've been waiting for. They miss you. They have not let you go. They've been dreaming about you, my love. So, I mean, this person, they really want to have a heart-to-heart -heart talk with you. Right now is the divine timing. It's the time for this to happen. The universe could definitely have a hand in bringing you two together, okay? Especially if this is a, um, you feel like the person you're dealing with is a twin flame. It's time for the reunion to take place. Yay! Yeah, so that's what I'm saying for you, Libra. Very straightforward reading. I don't think that I need to um, extend this whatsoever because I feel like this is someone who is really coming in um, with an apology. They're really coming in for a new beginning in love with you. Page of Pentacles, this is my phone call. FaceTime, but just expect that they will call you. Um, for a small percentage of you, they may send you a long text message. But the Page of Pentacles is very thoughtful communication. It's, it's you know, putting thought into it, okay? It's not just a random, hey, what you doing? Type. It's really putting thought into it because you care. So that's what I'm saying for you, Libra. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the reading. I love you all very much, and I will see you next time.